Pete David here from Guy Recommended. Going through our Flag Time Vice Reviews box opening. So earlier we did our Apex and in the same box came, I think this is the Regal Fly Time Vice. Regal Traveler Fly Time Vice. So only, unless there's a couple in this guy, only one or two more to go in this series. So let's open this guy up. This is the Regal. First off, pretty small compared to some of the other vices we've been looking at. The clamp, so we're gonna do you go through the list. So the Regal. 190 bucks, 190 bucks. Top, kind of getting towards the top end of our price spectrum. 4.5 on the Amazon rating scale. What do we get? We get a base, a base. Hmm. Interesting, in the pictures, I would have thought this base would have weighed a whole lot more it's relatively light. I mean, it looks looks massive, but um, let's weigh this guy. I got it on my scale here. One pound, eight ounces. One pound, eight ounces. So in retrospect, our Griffin's, Griffin's mongoose was three pounds, eight ounces, and our peak was a monster. Let's see if I got it here. A peak oh, I don't know on this side was um, four pounds six ounces. So I mean a third of the weight of our peak. It almost looks like there's something missing here. Oh, here we go. So not much in here. I believe. This is, is it American made? It says Massachusetts. Assemble, disassemble, Regal Engineering, hook placement. Um, it looks to be American made, although I was hoping it would jump out and say that closely. Warranty. All right, so this is our Regal. Not much in this package. $190. Let's get this thing open. Assembly. I suspect. I do like this knob. Um, we'll talk about fit and finish as we go along. Um, it's a, I think it's a cast. It must be a cast base of some type. Got a nice little emblem. So with the Regal, it has this uh, pinch clamp, which is nice, different. I've never really tied with one. I don't know if I would call it a true rotary. The rotary works this way. I guess you could call that a rotary, right? The tension comes from this guy here for locking it. Never really tied with them. Regal. I can, yeah. So one of the things I really like about a heavy base, now this is a custom made heavy base. Uh, this thing weighs uh, over five pounds, almost six pounds. I can crank like deer hair flies, all right? Two things. See how the vise, the clamp is over the weight um, the Regal, you can see how that guy's going to be way out over, over the base of this thing. 
I'm gonna tell you, it might be easy to flip that guy. Even my Renzetti Traveler, again, another Traveler, two pounds, 12 ounces, to two pounds, three ounces. Um, I, these are pretty close. But if you take a look at this guy, the base extends almost as far as the vice clamp, the clamp itself. Okay, what do we want to do here? So coming up, we got our, talked about the cost, weight, what's in it. Pretty straightforward. Um, does have a rotary. You hook, I'm looking for a hook here that I haven't bent. I've been bending these things up as a test of our clamp. Um, ease of assembly, obviously that was really easy. It came with a wrench. I'm sure that's to adjust this, but it's in a pretty comfortable spot right now, which would be the height. Fairly small, compact, traveling, that would be a good deal, good thing. Um, fit and finish. Uh, very well machined. <laughs> it's almost like beautiful accents. You got this brass, brass here. Um, a rubber, rubber cover on our vice handle. Um, another brass thumb knob here. From that aspect, it is kind of fit and finish. Very nice. I would give it fit and finish a nine out of ten. Nine out of ten. Um, ease of assembly. That's got to be one of the easiest ones I've assembled to point. So. 9 out of 10. Um, the weight of the base, I'm going to give it almost the worst score. It is the lightest base so far that I've weighed. Um, let's try our clamp. The thought of clamping stuff quickly this way just is a really cool thing. All right, so I got it in there. I've been doing the, can I bend it? So you can see how even even trying to bend stuff on the, like the peak, it would not bend, and we knew it was so heavy, but um, clamps really well. I am spinning that hook right around. Clamp is pretty nice. So clamp-wise, I would give it a eight out of 10. Um, reason why I'm not giving it a nine or a 10, it's not a true rotary. A true rotary would be more like this guy, right? The idea a lot of times with the rotary is to, you know, you tie it on something and then you can, you know, easily, now I got this really loose, right? Go through and, and feed material onto it. So that's the Regal. Let's recap real quick. Cost, 190 bucks. It's top end of the spectrum I'm looking at. Rating, Amazon 4.5. Um, 23 ratings. Uh, the weight, we had that down. Overall weight, 2.4 ounces. What's in it? Pretty straightforward. You've got the vise and a base. No seat clamp like you'll get on some of the other vices. Um, no additional uh, bobbin holders, none of that stuff that you'll see in some of the others. Um, ease of assembly, obviously that guy was really easy to assemble. Fit and finish, again, nine out of 10 there. Clamp, um, never tied with it, but I, so far clamps really well. I was able to crank it right down. And overall, I'm gonna give the Regal um, seven out of 10 would be my score. Really, the one downside is how easy it would be to tip this guy. So that's the Regal. Again, we're gonna make this part of our shootout, which will be some timed, tying, timed, tying um, with each of the vices. I'm gonna tie, I think I'll tie like a little Griffiths gnat then switch over to a woolly bugger and see how long it takes me to put those two flies together, spin them up, so. Hey, before we go too much farther, take a quick break. If you can, in the description below is a link to a free little class. It's a video, 20 minute video with downloads, how to set up a fly rod for dry fly fishing. 
comes with some download PDFs, it comes with video instructions. Um, also, later in the sequence of emails, I just share some great stuff. Checklists of fishing gear, um, a list of like 50 fly fishing tips I've used over the years. Some good stuff, so check it out in the description.